Module 6, Immunizations with a New Care Plan. So what we want to do is we want to open up the medical record of the client and click the Immunization <coughs> icon. This will show us all existing care plans. In this case, a client has been vaccinated for H1N1. And notice the status and the date given are accurate and the status is complete. So what we want to do is we want to click New <coughs> to open up the care plan window. Then we'll select our care plan from the list available. In this case we want BC, CDC, uh, IMM, BCI. We uh, check the information. We check the enrollment date. In case it's today's date, it will default to or we can make it to a past date. And we check the point of service, the provider. We click OK and it will create all interventions located underneath this care plan. Um, each intervention will have multiple immunizations with it. So if we notice all of these, the status of these is, is either overdue or still due. So what we need to do is we need to double click the intervention or an immunization under the intervention and notice that within this intervention, the two month intervention we have multiple Im immunizations such as Infantrix. Um, so what we need to do is we need to go into each of these immunizations, each of these separate immunizations and enter in the batch number and the expiry date using the calendar provided by profile. Once we do that we click on the next in, uh, immunization again change the batch date and the expiry and finally we move to the last one. We can also change the route and the site of the immunizations if, if necessary. Notice how we can change the date without opening up the calendar if that's uh, easier. Once we click OK, all of, this, all of these immunizations within that intervention are now marked complete with the date given, the age, the batch and the site of the injection. So that's all for today. Thank you very much.